Heaven's California Hey guys, today I'm going to be reacting to a video by Dark and Twisted. This one is called The True TikTok Horror Story Animated. This is the second video of Dark and Twisted out of four, which again, I hate when people start like, you know, uploading when I can't watch. Like it just it drives me insane. I think I saw that in the very first video that I did today. Like if you hear anything downstairs, ignore that. But yeah, this one's about 2 minutes 44 seconds. And again, it's a TikTok horror story and I know someone who does TikToks. So, I might sell this to him. <laughs> Let's go. I have a TikTok account. I don't use, like, use it though. I don't really care. I'm just kind of like, eh. I don't really care. A dark and twisted true story. I met this woman. Okay, that's enough. She offered for me to come over to her house for a TikTok party to celebrate the app. No. When I arrived, it was about to knock on the door. There was a note that said, come in. No, I'm gonna go out when first. I entered, Bye. It was completely dark except like. for the moonlight that seeped through the window. That's creepy. The light should be on. Yeah. For some stupid reason, I agreed to Wait, play the game okay. and went searching for her. It was <sighs> so dark that I had to feel my way through, which led me to the basement. Of course, that's where you wound up. Foul odor that mimicked the stench of rotting flesh. And Dead bodies. A voice came from the darkness. Looks like you found me, she said. And when I flashed my cell phone, Okay. Oh my goodness. And to the walls were dead and mutilated bodies. What the fuck? What the actual fuck? Yeah. I said as I Jesus. Ran out of the house and called the cops. Oh my god. Come to find out she was a mentally disturbed woman who used the app to lure me into her basement to kill them. Jesus. Oh my god. Okay, so obviously I get, like, I don't get it. Like, I'm not saying it's right, but obviously if she has an like, mental illness, then I get it. Because a lot of people like that don't want to do it. They just think that, like, what they're doing is right. You know, like, you never know what they're, like, they're thinking. You, you, you never know what their brain tells them to do. Which obviously we know what her brain told her to do, but... It's definitely scary, because, like, you never know who you're gonna meet. Like, you just never know, which is why you don't do it. <laughs> That's it. Don't don't like I don't I, I don't care if you like them. I don't care. I know there's like a lot of stories where people meet on, on dating apps or some kind of app and then they end up being married. That's cool, but that's not always gonna happen. And sometimes it'll be great and it'll be like the, the love of your life. And sometimes it'll be the end end of your life. So if you do do that, be a freaking aware. Bring a gun. Bring a knife. I don't know. Bring something. Cause psh, I'm, I'm 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 surprised that girl uh, the guy even escaped. Jesus. Uh, I'm just glad he survived, but I feel bad for all those freaking dead bodies in there. Jesus. Like, how the hell do you nail a bo Oh my god. Okay, that's it. I'm done. <laughs> anyway, guys, I'll see you guys in the next video. Thank you guys for watching, but not gonna lie, that was a really good video. Like, kind of kind of ter terrifying, but like, just like in the sense of a good video, that, that was really good. Just pretty damn scary, but yeah. Thank you guys for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.